So if you follow the oxygen sensor wire up, you'll see this white connector here. Press on the locking tab, unplug it, and that usually is best when you unthread it, otherwise the wire will keep wrapping itself around itself. So now let's unbolt it. There we go. Watch out when it breaks free. Let's just go ahead and remove it the rest of the way. There it is. Take the new O2 sensor and slide it in. Thread it on. It should already have some anti-seize on the threads. That's going to prevent it from sticking on there in the future. All right. Now you can either take a 22 millimeter wrench or your O2 sensor socket. Give this a nice snug. All right, don't make it too tight. You just wanna crush this little gasket that's in there. That's what's gonna make a nice tight seal. Now let's route the wire to where it belongs. Okay, here's the connector. Plug it in. Make sure it clicks. There we go. And if yours fell off, resecure it. <laughs>